coming into this game, I guess, what were some of the main focuses that you guys had or the coaching staff emphasized? Um, definitely the neutral zone. We talked about that before the game. Uh, you know, we feel like teams are, you know, building too much speed on us and getting through us a little easy there. And, <clears throat> and then that kind of leads into our arrival in the D zone and different things like that. So just kind of, you know, stopping them and, you know, kind of killing their speed so we can, you know, get out of, out of our own zone easier. What do you think were the main problems in the first period and how did that change over the second and third? Uh, just work ethic, little little work details, little stick details. We, um, you know, came out a little flat and, you know, they kind of just took advantage of us being a little lazy or, you know, not focused um, to start this game. And, you know, in the second we kind of got back to it. So it's, it just has to be a staple to our game. And, um, you know, we know that those things are non-negotiable kind of going into games, especially early on. Torch shut off the lines a little bit. I guess, what did that do for you guys? Um, yeah, I mean, after the first, he, he kind of let us know um, our work wasn't there and kind of how that has to be our, our MO um, just with this team and whatnot and, you know, changing the lines. So um, I think, you know, changing the lines or whether he got us going, um, you know, between the periods or we just kind of reset and, um, you know, refocus and had early just talk or whatnot, um, just kind of got back to the basics. That was <clears throat> kind of what we needed and kind of what led to a lot of our goals and a lot of our success, um, not only in this game, but kind of these first uh, 15 or so games. Going down 2-0, not once, but twice, I guess, what can you take away from being able to erase both of those deficits? Yeah, I mean, we've done it early on in the season. We obviously don't want to keep doing it, but, um, you know, it's nice to get a point. But, uh, you know, the, these comebacks and these points are huge. But, um, you know, if we're playing with the lead and, you know, playing confident and playing simple like like we do when we're on our good stretches, if we do that a little more consistently, we'll be really tough to play against. You guys have had a 10 power play drought of goals. How big was it to get one tonight? Yeah, um, really big. I think in some of those games we only got like one or two power plays, so you know you can't really get get going. But um, I didn't even know we were kind of on a drought. You know, it felt like first Dallas we did a lot of good things, but um, obviously gave up a goal against. So that's, that's uh, tough. But you know, to kind of get going again and um, get those power play numbers up is is really big going forward here. I know you're only on the team for the end of last year, but I guess how does this team feel maybe better equipped to deal with being in a losing slump? Um, I, um, I think just the leadership, um, obviously there's a new focus, there's a new, um, you know, coaching staff, whatnot, new standard like we talk about and, you know, just kind of new hope with this team. Um, you know, we saw a good, you know, first 10 games and, um, a little tougher these past couple, but, um, you know, we know it's going to happen and we just got to kill these streaks and, you know, when we are our winning streaks, we got to keep those rolling. So, um, you know, it's just kind of consistency and getting back to work. We're on a tough stretch right now, just with games and whatnot, but um, you know we got the leaders in here to to do it, and we just need to find ways to, to win games. It's a huge road trip for us, and you know big point today. But moving forward, these next two games are really really must wins almost.